Hey homegirls, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tootie and I'm back with another video. So in today's video, I'm going to be showing y'all what's in my emergency kit for back to school. Perfect for college students, high school students, really any student. Um, so yeah, this is everything that I keep in my emergency kit. This is my emergency kit. It's this cute little bag. And it just like glam on it and colorful letters. And yeah, it's pretty big. It holds a lot, okay? I only paid $5 for it and it came from Dollar General, so. No, you don't have to go get no real expensive bag. Just go get you a little cute one that's actually affordable and that holds all your stuff. Let's get started. So the first thing I'm going to grab. Let me open it. The first thing I'm going to grab, first and foremost, if y'all don't have this, y'all are tripping. Have your charger on you. Um, I don't care where you go. Anytime you leave a house, you need a charger on you because your phone will go dead. Um, faster than you expect it to. Like, just keep your charger on you, y'all. That's self-explanatory. You don't want to be walking around with a dead phone. Like, how you gonna get in contact with people? How people gonna get in contact with you? Any emergency can happen. Be prepared. Have your phone charged and take your charger with you. Next thing I want to pull out for school. AirPods. Okay. Um, so if we all had a moments where we don't want to be bothered at school or it's just simply boring and we want to listen to our music, so go ahead and have your AirPods with you. Um, there's been plenty of times where I just want to tune into my music and I talk to nobody for a little bit or it's just, we not doing nothing in class and we got extra little bit of free time. So just listen to your music or y'all like when stuff playing on y'all phone. Y'all yeah, don't want everybody to hear. Yeah, have your AirPods. Next thing I'm gonna pull out is some tissues. Tissues, just in case if your nose running, just in case you need to wipe something off your face. Um, kind of like a napkin. Just have it, just in case you spill something, you need to clean something up. Your face get a little dirty. You need to blow your nose. You know, have your tissues. Next is this tie to go stick. This is just for like any little mess that you accidentally make on your clothes it can like easily take the stain away real quick um remove a stain or anything that you may make at lunch or with a marker with some something y'all y'all know how little pen marks little marker marks go ahead and clean it up real quick because you don't want to be dirty looking like a kindergarten at school keep yourself clean keep yourself fresh keep yourself looking good a lint roller yes i said lint roller just because sometimes we have them shirts that we don't notice that got lint on them until we get to school or dog hair or regular hair like this is not really mandatory but it's just safe to have i have a toe bag and i know like when my toe bag touches a certain type of material or like fabric it gets like lengthy lint linty yeah, it gets linty and you know, you gotta go ahead and touch it up real quick. You don't want it to be looking dusty and that's exactly how it be looking. I actually have a tampon, a panty liner, or a pad. Whatever you use. Me personally, I use all three. So of course, all three of these are gonna be in my kit. Us girls do not know the specific time that our cycle is going to start. So it's always mm -hmm. mandatory for us to be prepared. You don't want to be that girl that go around asking, oh, can I have a tampon? Can I have a pad? Because, like, we females. We're supposed to keep that. You know, if fans are butts about it. Thing is some flushable wipes. They don't have to be flushable, but they're cleansing wipes. Full desks are dirty. Pencil sharpeners are dirty. Pencils are dirty. Pens are dirty. Boards textbooks any school essential that somebody else touched before you is dirty and i promise nine times out of ten it did not get sanitized have you something to sanitize please 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 school has germs schools are not clean 
okay they're not clean i don't care what nobody tell you a first aid kit this is so cute i got this from target also i got that um tie to go pants from target and a lint roller from target if you haven't watched my productive day in the life vlog you should go watch because you will see me shopping for all this stuff but yes i have um a little mini personal first aid kit and you will find yourself getting a little minor cuts or a bleed out at school one day for real a paper cut a blister something you're gonna be bleeding one day and to avoid going all the way to a nurse for a simple band-aid you can just already have one on you so you don't gotta miss nothing in class you know just be prepared with this I feel like this is a good item to have and I feel like it's perfect like it's so compact it's so small and it has 12 things so it has gauze pads it has band-aids it has um hand cleansing wipes and yeah next thing I have is some deodorant if there's not anything else you put in your emergency kit put some deodorant let that be top number one okay because being mussy is not okay y'all for real like when i i ain't gonna lie y'all when i smell somebody i get reminded of that smell every time i see them you don't want to be that person that's known as the musty girl because when somebody smell you once that's your nickname and they hit forever okay please 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 don't be musty at school please do not stink at school Next up is some spray. This is the Soldi, Soldi, Janeiro, Janeiro, Soldi Janeiro, or Soldi Janeiro, when in Rio. I have a whole collection of these, but this one has been my favorite. And it just smells so good and refreshing. This is an everyday to go spray. You don't always have to have designer sprays on you just because if your emergency kit get lost or stolen, that means somebody just got some free Burberry Gucci, uh, Chanel, I like the bag. <laughs> that means they just got some free perfume and no. Um, this was probably only like $25 and yeah, smells good. It lasts all day and affordable. Some lotion. Okay. This is some Dragon's lotion, y'all. It's not focusing. I really don't know why the camera not focusing. But this is Dragon's. I like to keep a mini lotion because not only does my hands probably will get ashy, but maybe my elbows, maybe my legs, maybe my knees, and my ankles. Get you a little mini lotion. It all works the same. Some sanitizer be sanitary okay when you touch let me put it like this say you in the classroom and your teacher not letting y'all leave the classroom you need to go wash your hands or your hands feel dirty all y'all do is put on your own sanitizer sanitizer is like essential like essential like there has been many times where I needed sanitizer and did not have it because I did not have my emergency kit with me. Next, y'all, is some lip balm. And I got this from Dollar Tree. And this is Palmer's Coconut Oil Formula Lip Balm. It's tiny and compact, so it wouldn't take up too much room up in your emergency kit. Next, y'all, is some lip gloss. This is considered lip oil but it gives lip gloss like it's super shiny i got this from my beauty supply store and i love it okay the lip balm goes good with the lip gloss and it just this next item is for my individual girlies that get their individual lashes done keep you a spoolie okay when you have individuals your lashes will always need to be like combed out throughout the day just like your hair so go ahead and just keep your spoolie in your bag this is from you can get these on amazon sheen like a whole hundred pack for like probably a dollar fifty or two dollars at the most your lash text should provide these if they don't maybe you can ask but this next item is for my strip girlies so i have some lash glue um this is some clear glue this is my favorite type of glue to use it's only it's kind of dirty throughout the day your strip lashes can live they can come off um 
yeah like you don't want to be walking around with no lash hanging or you know one lash come off you don't have no lash glue and now you gotta take both of them off now you're looking like a naked mole rat and <laughs> people looking at you crazy like i just seen you earlier you had your lashes on where your lashes go like yeah next is some nail glue it will be a time where your nail just pop off for no reason i've been through that so many times and keeping nail glue on you you could just easily put your nail back just to get you through the day. You don't have to worry about walking around with one nail missing or, you know, however many nails come off. Or sometimes, you know, the girls do the press-ons. I had on press-ons earlier, y'all, and, like, one of them popped off. Prime example today, like, one of them popped off, and I had my nail glue on me, and I just glued it back on. Like, having this stuff just saves the day. Us females go through many inconveniences throughout the day when we could just save ourselves by having an emergency kit next up is a brush and a comb um our hair has to be touched up throughout the day no matter what no matter if you um got a wig if you got a sewing brush your hair because it will get tangled it's not gonna stay perfectly fine through the whole day like that's just not realistic at all i have edge control and an edge brush because you know like me right now i have braids i have to touch up my edges they do not stay whatsoever i can do anything and they will not stay i don't know how to fix that but i keep my edge brush and my edge control in my emergency kit so i can just go ahead and fix them up real quick when i need to or whenever they start lifting or getting back curly again because honestly i can't stand that next is some gum don't be walking around with no stink breath like don't nobody want to smell that or even, like, you can even help the next person. Like, you know, somebody's breath not smelling too good. Offer them some gum. Help somebody else help yourself. Bring you some gum. Because after lunch, don't nobody want to smell that breath. Having stink breath is the biggest turn off. It's embarrassing. It's not cute. It's not a good look. It's not a good smell. And hygiene is very important. Next up is some rubber bands. Um... Some people like me have braces and we gotta wear these bands all day every day and they do pop like they pop at any moment and it's very annoying next up i have some hair ties um hair ties is essential for every day like there's been many of times that people have asked me for a hair tie or there's been many of times where i ask other people for a hair tie just because like hair gets annoying at school and you go to like chemistry class y'all doing the lab your hair gotta be pulled back you in pe you in gym you gotta pull your hair up real quick have your hair tie be prepared so you don't gotta ask nobody or go all the way to the office to go get one of them little raggedy rubber bands that nobody want to put in their head or you don't even know where it came from <laughs> Last but not least, have some cash on you. There's been plenty of times where I needed cash and it just saved my life. I probably got like $8 right here. Don't have no more than $20 up in your emergency kit because if somebody take it, that's a free $20. And life be life in and you don't got time to be losing money. <laughs> money being lost is crazy, okay? People are thieves and they're not going to return it. Money is not going to get returned. You can lose your wallet with a hundred dollars in it and get everything back in a wallet except a hundred dollars so please do not bring a lot of cash as a human especially as a female we encounter problems every day that we can literally save ourselves from by having an emergency kit from little things such as gum deodorant spray anything we have problems every day that we don't know that we're gonna have. So by having an emergency kit, it just saves us so much time, so convenient by being prepared, okay? That is all for my emergency kit. Here it is, it fits everything. This kit can go in my backpack, can go in my tote bag, can go in my purse. This emergency kit can go anywhere I need it to go because it's not that big and it holds what I need it to hold. Thank you all so, 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 so much for watching. We're on the road to 2k that notification bell to be notified when your girl posts because period I hope you all enjoyed the video i hope you all miss me because i missed y'all i'm so sorry for the late post i'm so 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 sorry but yeah y'all that's all i have for y'all today bye